What's going on Beach Bums? I've been fishing already this morning, but of course I had to wait for the sun to come up before I could get some light to film an intro. I'm out here doing some light tackle whiting fishing. Uh, this is a star rod. This is the star aerial rod. Real light action on the tip. You can see right there. And I'm using a pompano rig, but this is a 10 pound test with a size one hook and just a purple bead. I'm also using just a one ounce sinker for the pyramid weight. So this is real light tackle. This is the way to go for whiting. Whiting fishing can be some of the trickiest fishing out here. Once you find them, usually you're gonna do pretty good, uh, but this is a lot of fun. This is a really fun way to catch fish. I've had a great morning already. You guys check it out. Here we go. We got a fish. Big hit here. First fish of the day. Let's see what we got. Oh, we got something over here too. Let's see what we got. Yeah. Nice. That's what we're after. You see how how big that hit was on that light tackle? Oh, it looked like a dang freight train. Oh, here we go. Oh, we got something on here too. Woo! Oh, this is heavy. Oh, this is real heavy. Oh, don't be a stingray. Please don't be a stingray. I think it might be a stingray. Oh. <laughs> I just I just hooked something big on this one. I think it might be a ray. If it's a red, that'd be awesome. Ah, man. Light tackle is uh, <laughs> a lot of fun. This is, uh, yeah. If it's a ray, it's not, it's not a big one, but it's, uh, it's big enough. No, no bird, no bird, no bird. Stay away from my whiting. Yeah. Maybe they're gonna have to break them off or spend a lot of time here. Yeah, we're just gonna have to break them off. There you go, take it, bud. Okay. That was annoying. Got a nice whiting. This is our target this morning. Got this beautiful whiting. This is our first whiting of the day. And on the light tackle is so much fun. I mean, it hit it and just crushed it. So definitely the way to go. I mean, you know, this isn't like a monster whiting, but good keeper size. And uh, that, that's the goal today. So that was a lot of fun. <laughs> yeah, something going on here. There we go, there we go. That's a good one. That's a good one. Come here, buddy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. Heck yes. Now we're getting somewhere. Man, these are so much fun <laughs> on light tackle. <laughs> these guys are so much fun on light tackle. I mean, just, just a blast. Still got one line in the water there but these fish are crazy man like they are the hardest to hang on to and they just go nuts craziest fish out here oh this is a good fish man i just put it back out there real good fish real good fish what is that oh yeah <laughs> oh it's a whiting he's not even huge but man he feels like a beast Woo! look at that look at that <laughs> oh there you go nice that's a, that's the biggest one of the day right there check that out that is so cool so much fun on uh on the light tackle they just feel gigantic awesome fish uh, he's about the same size as the other two but man he uh <laughs> he was he was a fighter i thought i might have had a pompano or something it's so different when you're using uh 
using the lighter setups. Get another bait out here. Bites picked up just a little bit. We just picked up two here pretty quickly. See if we can get another. A lot of crabs out here this morning. They keep grabbing it. I've, uh, I think I've pulled like three or four to the beach already. That good bite that we were having slowed down. So I pushed the bait further out on the other side of that bar out there. Just to go a little deeper, see if maybe they pushed out a little bit. I'll still keep one close because that's typically where you're going to find your whiting. It's close in and that's where all these that I've caught so far have been. I have been out here at this location and we've caught some stud whiting on the back of the bar. So I would love to get a nice big one. Oh, there we go. Thought he had it, thought he had it. Oh, what do we got? 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 Okay. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yes, sir. That's what I wanted. That's on the back of the bar. We'll see if he uh, pushed out. Woo! Big hit on that one. Yeah, something on our other rod here. Uh, let's see if we can get this guy in. Oh yeah, what is this? Oh yeah, nice whiting. Real nice. That's a good one. Heck yeah. Or is that a red? Is that a red? Oh, that's a whiting. <laughs> that's a big one. All right, let's see if this guy's still here. Probably got off. Oh uh, yeah, he's gone. Man, I love it when a plan comes together. He, man, he choked it. Look at that guy. <laughs> oh yeah, we've been catching some big ones out here. Check that one out. Hoss, man. That's a good one. That's a, that's a respectable whiting right there. Digging that one, man. That was on the back of the bar. Like I said, we've been catching some big ones out there and uh, the bite has slowed down in close. So just change things up. You know, I talk about that a lot, trying to find that right zone. And it'll change on you while you're out here. Let's let's get a measurement on this guy. Oh yeah, this guy is 15 and a quarter. Sweet. That's almost a legal redfish. Redfish gotta be 16 here, so he's just shy of legal redfish length. That's when you know you got a good one. That is awesome. go another another whiting this will probably be my last one this will make six and that is plenty for me and my wife for dinner well this guy is not very big but again i've got some whiting so i'm gonna go ahead and add him to what i've got this will be plenty for me and my wife we got that one big one which man that, that was a solid fish but six is plenty six six of uh just a little bit bigger than this six usually is enough for me and my wife it's enough fillets to fry up some fish and have a nice dinner but this was a lot of fun like i whiting kind of get overlooked whiting is usually i mean obviously they're great fish a lot of people do love to catch them and they're great to eat but a lot of times people think man they're just not worth catching there's no fun but if you come out here with the right tackle with the right setup and you really get to feel that fight it is so much fun i mean i i could sit here and do this all day long unfortunately i can't i've got to go <laughs> me and my wife have things we got to get done today so i better get back but uh thanks for hanging out with me on the beach this morning got dinner had a lot of fun doing this probably will have to come out and do it again for myself because this was pretty enjoyable but guys appreciate you watching and as always you stay bummy